Joe Pegg here with Robala Boats. We're at the Fort Lauderdale International Boat Show 2021. We're about to do a walkthrough on Robala's best-selling center console, the R272. This model is packaged with lots of features for both the family and fishing. We're gonna start off here in the bow and I'll show you some of the features. Come take a look. Starting off in the front, you've got a nice big anchor locker up here with a windlass and plenty of access for your uh, rope and chain. Also, you have bow controls for your windlass from the front. You've got a nice deep bow area for sitting, lounging. Um, you've got the standard bow backrest, removable bow cushions. Underneath both compartments, you've got insulated fish boxes or insulated storage, as well as an insulated cooler up in the front center. Notice you don't have to take the cushions off every time to open the latch like a lot of our competitors. The bow fills in with a cushion or a filler piece to make it a casting deck or a table, so it converts to three different uh, accessories. Down on the floor, you've got a nice deep storage compartment with dedicated storage for your side ladder and lots of storage for other accessories as well. And moving on to the head, Robala does a forward access head versus a lot of our competitors that do it from the side. The advantage of having an access door from the front is you end up with a much wider entry that you can step down into it. So it's much easier to access. You've got a wider entry point. Uh, you don't feel claustrophobic. It's got plenty of space. It's got a window. It's got an electric toilet um, and storage down here and access to uh, behind your helm. One of my favorite features of the 272 is the oversized hardtop. You end up with lots of shade, lots of weather protection with this boat. Also, you've got a three-piece tempered glass windshield on the boat with an electric vent that opens up to allow air to run through. And if it's a rainy day, you can actually shut the vent. Moving on to the helm of this boat, you've got a nice low profile dash. So you've got plenty of visibility while you're driving, whether you're sitting or standing. The helm is nicely equipped with dual 12 inch displays with a flush mount acrylic uh, dash, push button light up stainless steel switches, a cell phone charger at the helm, cup holders, a glove box, a premium stainless steel steering wheel, flip up bolster pads with a nice high backrest all the way across, large enough for two people or even to uh, put a kid in between uh, two people. You've got double footrest here at the helm and this is the optional helm pad at the front and this is also equipped with the JL Audio upgrade which includes a subwoofer. In the back of the boat, Robalo pushes the live well over to the corner so it maximizes the amount of cockpit space. You've got an oversized live well with a clear lid so you can easily uh, see your baits while you're out fishing. The live well is insulated. Over here, you've got a full-size aft seat that tucks away for fishing. And it's a very comfortable three-person seat here in the back of the boat with a nice high ba uh, backrest with lumbar support. And it folds away very easily underneath this seat. It's full access to your bilge, batteries, and all your components. And then coming to the back of the boat, you've got a transom walkthrough door that brings you to a large swim platform. And one of the unique features too is it's got a bridge so you can walk from one side to the other without having to walk through the transom splash well with the rigging tubes. Thank you for watching. That concludes our walkthrough of the Robalo R272. This boat can be paired with either 200s or 250 Yamahas. And for more information, check us out at our website at www.robalo.com.